Question 13 is all about coordinates. It says Alfie places three cubes on a coordinate grid. One, two, three. The base of a shape is a rectangle. Now the base basically means bottom. So we're talking about the bottom of a shape being a rectangle. So if we can just imagine the bottom of that rectangle, that would make things a lot easier. So there would be one side of the rectangle at the bottom of the shape. There's another side. The back side of the rectangle would go backwards through there. And then it would the final side would be like that. So that would be the rectangle at the base if the shape is made from the cubes. So that's what we're talking about. Now it says the four vertices of the rectangle are. Remember vertices is a posh word for corners. And we've been given three of them. Two, three, this one. Five, three, this one. Five, four, this one. The only one we haven't been given Try and mark with a different colour is that one at the back. So we're focusing on what the coordinates of that point is. Easiest way to do it is from that point, draw a line all the way down and all the way across. And then we can just read the numbers from the grid. We've got a 2 there and we've got a 4 there. Now remember, when you give coordinates, Starting from zero, you have to go along the corridor first, then up the stairs. So from zero here, along the corridor is two. So that goes first. And then up the stairs is level with, we've got to go one, two, three, four up. So that's got to be four. Just to double check, starting from zero, we go one, two along. And then one, two, three, four up. And we get that missing coordinate at the back of that rectangle. Final answer, two comma four.